What's going on guys? So today Apple held its WWDC keynote and one of the biggest things talked about that we were all expecting was iCloud. iCloud is essentially a way to keep and share all of your media in between your iDevices and your computer. And one of the biggest things they talked about was iTunes integration into the iCloud. So anything you buy from one device is pushed through the cloud and then pushed back to any other device that you have. So say you buy a song from your iPhone, it's gonna be pushed to the cloud and then if you have an iPad or an iPod Touch or um, a different computer, you can push it all the way back down to your iPad or your different computer. So instead of having to go to your computer, sync it to your iTunes library, and then sync it back to any other device you have, everything is just wirelessly pushed and, and filtered in between all of your devices. So this is the um, iCloud page on Apple.com. I'll have a link down in the underbar to where you can see this for yourself. But again, it just talks about how all your purchased music is synced um, kind of in a circle all the way around um, your iDevices and your computer. Another thing they talked about was photo stream. Um, with iCloud, when you take a photo on one device, it automatically appears on all your other devices. Again, basically how iTunes works. You take a picture, it goes to the cloud, and then pushes it to your computer, to your iPad, to your iPod Touch. Uh, anything that you have, it's just going to be pushed to all your iDevices now. So instead of having to go to your computer, open up iPhoto, or open up iTunes, and syncing different albums, or, or pushing different photos around to your different devices, you can do that um, nice and easy wirelessly through the iCloud iCloud also works with apps, books, documents, and it also continually backs up um, a lot of your apps and a lot of your information. Again, all access apps, you download a lot of apps, now you want to see them in one convenient place. Your purchase history is stored in the cloud, so anything you purchased is going to be backed up and displayed. iBooks is also supported. Documents. Documents with pages, um, keynotes, numbers. Um, anything that you type up, anything that you create in any of those iWork applications is going to be saved, pushed to the cloud, and then pushed to all your other iDevices. So great for a business person who needs a presentation pushed to his computer or to his iPad. Um, just a really good integration with um, documents and backup. Now iCloud also backs up a lot of your information. So when you set up a new iDevice, you need to restore the information that you already have. You can do that through the cloud. Um, and you can also back up all your information automatically over Wi-Fi instead of having to go and sync to your computer and all that stuff. And then one last thing they talked about was contacts, calendar, and mail. It stores your email calendar and contacts and automatically pushes them to your other iDevices as well. If you have an email on, in one place and you want to push it to another, or if you have a calendar event or anything you need to push it to another place, you do that as well. Your contacts are also um, you know, automatically pushed around from your iPhone, your iPod Touch, your iPad to your computer. So just a really, really good way to sort of integrate all of your data all of your information from one device to another, whether it be from your iPod Touch to your computer or if you have a number of other iDevices, um, just a much, much easier way to store all of your information. Now the cloud will be available in the fall. There are a few features of the cloud that are available right now, but with iOS 5, it will be available in the fall with 100% full, all the features, all the integration. It is all free. Now, basically what they talked about was this is the new mobile me. Uh, mobile me is discontinued. Everything that you had with mobile me is going to be with the cloud and the cloud is 100% free. So all your data, all that information going to be synced around from all your iDevices uh, through the cloud wirelessly without having to sync to your computer, any of that stuff, um, just much, much easier. So let me know what you think of the iCloud, if you'll be using it, how you'll be using it, what your thoughts are. Um, definitely want to hear your opinions in the comments below, and I'll see you guys in the next video.